Hello there everyone and welcome back to Old World Blues A to Z series in which we're playing as a thick Mexico. Um, but we're going to talk about Los Besos Organicas. Finally, the Lux legacy has been secured and at last I can rest easy knowing his children are safe and that my, my brothers are finally under control. Never again will I let them spread the corrupted influence over the Mexican people. They'll be wiped from the network since every trace of the abomination of existence is erased. Still, their specific subroutine could prove useful in the future. But then we'll do, uh... Tlaloc's favorite sons, many of my brothers saw fit to steal Tlaloc's secrets, as well as research, and using it for their own twisted purposes, with them now finally destroyed and their data banks under my control. I can finally begin to study the many advances and mountain of the data that fathers left me. Hopefully they'll serve the interests of the people around this time. Let's let time go on, as we are actually going to go ahead and go to war. Oh, wow. We have a crud ton of factories. Look at all that uh, scrap we have. Um, here, do that. Do that. We're going to need more scrap. We're always going to need more scrap. But we're going to go to war with Shell's army because we're not quite ready, but I don't care. I want to go to war. We've got plenty of manpower. I'm not concerned about that at all. And then uh, hardline approach. Just like the hubris of the old world caused its end, so does a new uh, world's democracy set their sight upon the same path. Oh, we'd be at peace for that. The Republic of the Rio Grande cannot be allowed to gain the keys to Armageddon Station lest they destroy everything I and Father have worked towards. The quest for power ends today. Which, they're already dead, but you know, whatever. So I didn't realize we had to be at peace for that other focus. We have over 100 naval XP, which means nothing, but pressure the b border. I can see it as clear as day in their demeanor, their words, their politics. Rio will stop at nothing to gain the keys to Armageddon and go on to use the treasures of Mexico to conquer its people and enslave them. But I won't let it happen. It is time for to prod their defenses and prepare. I'll stand in their way until my last breath and darn the consequences. Seizing Armageddon. Two keys. Rio already has two keys. And from what little I know, they might as well already have taken a third. Do they believe themselves invincible that they fly so close to the sun, ignorant of the fact that their wings are burning? I cannot allow them to gain that last key. I must take back control, whatever the cost. Father, forgive me for bringing the war to these lands once again. And Los Siete Les. For too long I have ignored my father's teaching in their lesson, and so it's time to pay my due to the people. To fulfill his legacy and leave the, uh, my mark upon this noble land. We'll allow them. Look at that. To form a bicameral congress, and elect deputies as well as senators to run local affairs. So let the citizenry enjoy the many liberties, and still allow me to guide them along the right path. And as basically we just took them all out. Overall, not bad. We're pretty thick. I think it's time to go to war for Pecos next. Maintenance is nice. We do have an occasional uh, division here, and by division I'm talking about a uh, special forces division, but I'm going to make them slightly unique for this campaign. That being said, this is a division, and I actually threw on all those CDNC scrap bots. It doesn't hurt armor, honestly, too much at all, because it's a good organization still. It doesn't help us out with that much, but we threw on three, three of them, just because we're a, uh, well, we're a very robot-heavy nation. So Overall, not bad. we got some field works done, which is very, very good. And what is next for us? Shale's army, thank you. We'll take all the screening ships possible. Cool. Daily command power gain? Sure. Oh, why not? Ah, and uh, da digital data links just finished. Good. Very nice. Um, Pecos. Well, honestly, we don't have a lot of things to work with here. You're the invader group. Uh, a division doesn't seem like very much, but that's okay. Oh, I forgot about all this stuff down here. One division to hold off? I think that's good enough. But this will open up Lanius to us as well. Um, that's the last one. Cool. And let's go and do this one. We're not going to go to war just yet. We're going to wait and do that one first. You get right there. Have a buddy. Nice. Go and train real quick because I do want to get finished that other focus first. And we've got a crap ton of manpower. My god. Uh, building up roads, which is nice. I still need more scrap though, so we're going to build it right there. Nice. Up next, I'm actually going to go ahead and. I don't mind this, but we're going to go down here because I don't want to hurt our stability too much. Oh, it costs 250. Oh, good god. That's a lot. But we can talk about the southern threat too. Uh, or does this should this this should be about bypass? There you go, nice. Mexico are born. We get a claim on every Mexican and Texan state, and we're known as the Republic of Mexico. Ooh, trade from Hawaii. Ooh, we're going about this. Please go ahead. Trade with Hawaii. Captain come goes up. Sure. The Southern Threat. <coughs> a lesser man would have dealt with the Mayans years ago. Their rights and barbaric ways an affront to a civilization itself, but luck was kind, so he didn't act. 
The luck was generous, so they gave him gifts, hoping to steer them towards a better path. Yet they became a set in their ways, complacent and ignorant of his kindness. It is time for the wrath of a lesser man to deal with these savages once and for all. Nice. Researching. Very fast. I love it. It's a little out of town, but uh, I don't really care. Land doctrine is nice. Sentry bot mark ones, yes please. Wilderness survival training, sure. Do that, that, thank you. Tlaloc's favorite son, thank you very much. Telegraph, uh, supply range, sure, why not. Sophisticated industry tech, as well as construction tech, thank you very much. Good. Bakos! Probably gonna stop training. Go on and have a good time. Oh, I forgot to give you guys orders. God dang it. Improved radar, nice. There we go. Encryption. And we're in. Oh, the Legion Civil War. Oh, please don't crash the game. Please. Nice. Sons of Vulcan. Legion of Hades. Kaisis. I've always wondered, wondered how to get this guy. Stay the decimation. Huh. Using every tool. Legion of Hades sounds like a lot of fun. Aurelius is Legion too. Not bad, but I guess it's just simple pass you can go down. Oh, did we lose it here? Oh, they they encircled us. That's that's right. They do that. Well, you guys can come down here, I suppose. So while they're killing themselves, we might go to Lubbock next. Nice. Anything else here we really want? Sniper? Life giver. It's fine with me. Go go ahead, go to Van Horn. Thick. Go and terminate him. Also, we did throw in quite a few planes here to help us out. Every single one of these armies have, at the very least, fighters, so we should be doing a good amount of damage. There we go. Decide some engagement. Yeah, I don't want to lose any defense. I like a more ground attack factor, but I don't want to lose any defense at all. Telingua? Nice. Good. Oh, God. How many screening ships do they have? Love it, okay. There you go. That's all you really need, pretty much. There you go. I want you to power drive from here to there. I want you to power drive from here to like there. I want you to just kind of hang out. Nice. And. The port of Tampico. Tampico, the great, uh, the place of otters and Huastef, was a major port before the Great War. The Norte Americanos transferred the wealth of their occupation out of our country, never to return, will refit and modernize it. To have it serve as a mighty trading hub for the people of Mexico and increase their naval capabilities. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, well then, the southern threat. Guess we have to beat peace for that one, too. Uh, we're going to keep going on with that one. Destruction of Mount Rushmore. Oh, boy. There you go. And there goes Lubbock. Nice. Take a look at this real quick. Oh my god. Uh, a few bad cruisers. Only 111. Is that all? Like, the entire fleet is literally just, uh, like, destroyers. And maybe a capital ship. Maybe. Here. Nice. Even better bots. Love it. Um, build these two here because that'll help the trade node, hopefully. Houston. Build that there too. And build some more scrap things right there. There we go. Actually, where are we going for trade? Oh, wow. 40. It's not bad. Looking even thicker. 
Now, I wish these guys would finish off their war. Seriously. Come on. Come on now. Alright, so I don't see anything around here. So we're going to go over the last lodge. And do it like that. Oh, how many divisions that we actually have. We'll go right there. And we do that, that, that. We're going to start preparing a lot of air bases all around here. That would be nice, nice. And nice. Dedicated mechanics. Improved manufacturing. We're going to lower our manpower by quite a bit, but that's alright. Southern threat. Nice, everyone, for the war machine, which I really don't like. Um. I'm going to go to every cap of the army, or at least welcome to army at the very least. Because even though I like building a lot, um, I just heard mobilization or manpower and whatnot. My god. That was the best time for the NCR to have the Legion explode. Literally the best time. Nevada Protectorate, Eureka Territories. Nice. High Chapel, Timberline, Port Maw. Who is this? Washington Brotherhood? Looks like it. Uh, MacArthur's looking pretty good. Kingdom of Manitoba. The order's looking pretty thick. Robco Soltrons. I keep saying I want to do naval stuff, but I always forget about it. Anything else here? Nope. Well, let's get through this focus first and a little bit of war. Military statistics. Daily air. Army XP gain, uh, it doesn't really matter for sure. Um, there you go. Do that one. Three days left, not bad. Get more water, I guess. Ah. Improve manufacturing and then uh, peak efficiency. So there's even more recruitable population factor. We'll have like no population whatsoever. Whatever. Because I don't want recruitable means. I think I kind of want to go no means allowed. Keep hurting us. Who cares? No undesirables. This doesn't make any sense for where we're currently at, but whatever. Alright. Shielding the coast. If I want to maintain naval supremacy over the Aztec savages, I need a powerful enough navy to conquer their own. The homeland of many of my ex-militia officers have been offered as a staging ground in the campaign against Chichen Itza, and many citizens are more than willing to help me build up my forces. It is this un unity. There's willingness to stand and fight that I'll bring about the end of the tournament. Cool. A well-oiled machine. Petrochico's legacy seems to live on to this day, deep within the refinery. It seems that they have taken upon themselves to gain limited autonomy by constructing robot manufacturing plants, able to automate most day-to-day -day tasks. Or a purpose them to strengthen the might of my army and use them to strike ever deeper south. No tyrant shall be spared. Ooh. God, uh, God, no. Naval awakening. To protect and care for the people, we must make sure to cover any, every facet of warfare, from ground combat to naval battles. Our nautical capabilities are currently quite poor, if I'm to be honest. Catching up with our neighbors in terms of technology will be a first step towards securing Mexico's coasts. Nice. Going a little slower than I would have liked. We always are losing our people here. Why? Losses. And to, oh, Hentus. Oh, nice. Oh, it's close. We can't even see how much casualties we're doing. That sucks. Uh, only doing f roughly 30 to 40-ish damage. It's not good enough. More soft and heart attack. Good. Nice. Thank you, Les Lodge. Thank you for playing. We have quite a few waterways through here, which sucks, but whatever. Oh. We got more than enough divisions to do this in total. There you go. Systems are nice. Actually, I was looking over here. 
haven't done that yet. War gaming, nice. More entrenchment, trench works. Sure. Shielding the coast. Naval awakening. Big spend. Back resistant chassis. Robo brains. It's way ahead of time, but whatever. Mind. Let's deploy them all. And where are they gonna go? They're gonna follow the direction of this guy. Yeah. Nice. There you go. Oh, they're really attacking us, aren't they? He's level seven, nice. God, I wish we could see how much manpower they have or how many men they've lost. Are they going to do it again? I hope they do it again. It's really nice when they did it. Uh, oh, oh yeah, they're definitely attacking us again. Eh, only 130, is that all? Uh, there you go. Casualties for us. Over the past couple months, not bad. Not bad whatsoever. Well, we've had our fun with them. Uh, you know what? Let them attack one more time. I'm sure they'll attack one more time. Give them one more time. Try. Ooh, attacking up there. Nice. Yeah, look like they are hurting a little bit. I'm sure they'll attack, right? Ah, yeah, see? I was right. Ah, uh, barbaric. Love it though. Where are you guys at? You guys fighting over the rivers? Uh, you don't have the ability. You don't have it. You have it. Whatever. Let's go into that. Have fun. Oh, are they forcing defense? Oh god. Oh good god. They're literally just melting. I'm melting their divisions. Oh, that's so nice. Literally no hope for these guys. 50-ish damage. 17. Not good enough. Oh. Restore Shepherd Air Force Base. Ah, sure, why not? Well, old machine. Uh, naval requirements. With our technological edges secure, now we must make sure to manufacture said equipment to an extent where we can contest our neighbors. Investing heavily into the shipyards using Tempico's part previous economic buildup should see us well on the way to gain naval might. Stormtroopers? Sure. Basic power plants? Sure as well. So demobilizing though. Trench works. Demo teams? We're not even using demo teams, but whatever. Whatever. Going. Sure, why not? We'll be nice this time. We'll be generous. Nice. Wheat City? Tulsa, huh? Them painted rock. I want the people in the south just to finish off their war first. Come on. Oh, there goes big grass. You got him. Uh, for the most part, there's only one waterway, but. Economic resurgence, nice. Um, I guess if you want, you can get rooted. I suppose. That, that, then what? Minutes of Yucatan. Ah. 
Shylock never stopped believing in you. Not for a single second did he think it was futile to try and set you on the right path. Forever and always, caring for his children, and that's what him doomed him. Ripped him from this cruel world uh, away from me. But after all this, all those efforts, you still chose to disappoint him. And still, he would have forgiven you. Yet, I am but his humble son, so I do not have to. Found nothing, huh? Pretty typical. How much manpower do we get a month? 270... 257. I guess there is a waterway over here. Oh, there was one over here too, but whatever. It's not like it really matters at this point. Cruising all the way in. Having a good old time. Here, go this way. Stormtroopers, max entrenchment. Oh, hello. Experience soldiers lost, so that's what we really need for robots. There we go. Well, since they're taking forever, Lannis, you're up. You know what? Oh, you gotta do that. Well, you might not have numbers, so we'll have an air superiority. Good luck, y'all. Uh, sure. Uh, there you go. And here. A little more damage. Sure. Six hundred's already pretty good. <laughs> Energy weaponry is nice. You have requirements. Cool. We're pretty much done the focus tree for now. Eventually we'll do that one, and then Mexico will reborn. And finally it is done. I've devoted all of my existence to liberating Texas and worked tirelessly for the benefit of the Mexican people. But now with those goals accomplished, all that is left is to take stock of what remains. Father's resting place has been the center of my rule, but now with what's said and done, it became so cold, so silent. Maybe, maybe taking some time to rest is for the best. Well, let's see. They have 26 divisions? How do they only have 26 divisions? What the heck? Bruh. Bruh, 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 bruh. I want to wait for these guys to like finish killing each, other's off, each other off first, and then maybe go to war with them. Um, sure. These guys are taking forever to kill each other off. My god. What is wrong with you all? You have no manpower, you have 4,000, you have no manpower. God dang it. How does Elanius only have 26 divisions? What the heck? We're still, we're still demobilizing. Are we gonna have any manpower at all? 7, 4%. Effect total manpower modified to 44%. I guess Honduras is down here too, huh? There you go. Oh, you guys are done. Well, not really. There you go. Um, land for construction speed? Sure. Like, we totally need that right now. Art attack and piercing? Sure, why not? We'll gladly take it. There you go. How about war propaganda? Um, sure, why not? Soltrons. How much money do we have now? Oh, I thought we'd have more. Oh well. You go right there. Oh, 
Land uses failure. Beautiful. It's capital Dock City, yeah, that sucks. Alright, economic resurgence. And they're still fighting up here, but I mean is it really a fight? With how few how few divisions they really actually have? And these guys over here though. It's a maximum bunker. You know, just go to war with them anyways, who cares? Colorado Springs, all at the dog city. Wait, that's done. Uh probably I'll probably just go to war with them anyways. I don't think they can do very much against us. Oh, we're waiting for the Legion to kill itself still. Nothing like a good old Legion Civil War. Yeah, hey, Robot City. That's perfect for us. Nice. Defense it online. Ten more fighters. Don't really need ten more fighters, but we'll take them. West Coast section? Sh sure. Section Bot Mark IIs. Cool. Must, must mean we're done with the robots for now. Nice. Not bad. Do that anyways, because he can't. And there you go. Go and delete them. Looks like Vulpus is doing quite well. We'll go to war with these guys next. We still okay, so we're at eleven thousand manpower. I'm okay with that. We do have a few planes, but we got a thousand fighters, so I'm not super worried about it. Uh, here. Toluca? Nice. Let's see training. Good, good, good. Nice. Yeah. Watts, Watts is a consumer electronic schematics. Plate crossings. And CQC training, huh? Nice. There you go. Alright, let's get all the way down. It's going to take at least, at least a month probably to get down here. You guys do that. You guys probably do that. That. Good and it's there. There you go. Great news. Right control gear. And just in case, I'll do that anyways. For spies, good, good. Um, they didn't really build up this area too much, especially with uh, planes. So build it up. Check relief. Nice. No mutes allowed. Ah. Oh, we need five percent more. Holy crap! Uh, sure, I like more political power. Land reform, monthly population. <laughs> okay, five percent more population. Sure, why not? I think we could use that, right? Totally. One fifty, huh? Four fifty, huh? Station. Go ahead. This war's not gonna last very long. Did I forget to give you? God dang it! Nice. 
nice. Recoil compensation studies, very good. And security. I usually choose the one on the left. Let's go with the one on the right. High side guns. I like super maneuverability more. Because you can move faster. Or, you know, speed up faster, I guess technically not move faster. Eh, well. Yeah, technically it's more speed up faster. Modern nursing. You get it for the robots, you know? Nice. Yeah, nice. There we go. Now we have focus. We can do. Nope, we take him. Thank you, sir. No, those are our lands. You can't have them. I don't take the three, the three ships that they do have. Oh, there you go. There you go. Short artillery. You have a max range. There you go. There you go. It goes up here. Uh, 18 goes down here. Good. And what do we have here? So far, not bad. I mean, this is pretty easy. I mean, this is exactly what I wanted for a campaign. Because sometimes with some of these campaigns, it just drones on and on. And it's like, oh my god. This is difficult, and it's not easy, and it's not fun. Just like this. I like it. Santa Ana can easily just do super well. Ridiculously well. Nice. Sure. Mexico to born! Oh my god, oh, we're actually not doing super well here. Huh. What's air damage like? So over here, nothing. And down here, we got 82. So only 250, 300 planes. They do have a little bit of anti-air themselves. 130 is not bad, though. Should just be melting through them. Oh, hello. Sir, I would like one robot. Uh, please come back up here. Are we fighting them in the waters at all? I don't seem like we have very much to fight them with, though. I want you to occupy every naval weight or naval whatever they have. Yeah. You might be able to find something there to fight. You might not. We'll see. We should just be able to shred through everything they have. 4,000 manpower left. 23 divisions. How does Coast have more divisions? I'm I'm just really baffled sometimes, which is a weird word for me to use. Baffled. That's the last time you used the word baffled. But baffled as to why some of these you know, relatively should be powerful nations not be powerful enough. Doesn't make any sense to me. Uh, let's go to every cap. Why not? Paved roads. Max factories in the state level construction speed navigation. That's a, I've never actually got on this way. 20% more dockyard output. Wow. Have adoption cost? Well, I mean, it's a little late for that, but whatever. Any more damage? Only 85? Is that all? Santa Ana's birthday is good. Uh, keep working on the air stuff and get some stuff there too. And then I'm all die. Because I just want the Legion to be done. Like, come on. I mean, we will go to war with them. But, like, bruh. Uh, NCR is getting it. Oh, we have to call the NCR. That sucks. Mexico were born. Beautiful! Welcome to the Republic of Mexico. Now we know their focus is, huh? Resist suppression. Build stuff. Just keep the PP for now. God, I wish we could see how much we've done. Here. Come to Ujushitan de Zaragoza. Smoke grenades. Nice. No more money, huh? Oh, 
get all these armies to take out this one tile. Might be a bit excessive. Oh. Beautiful. Of course, we could naval invade too. You know what? We might do the naval invader, so. Legion of Hades demands territory. Well, are you sure you can actually do that, my laddies? It's going to nail me, babe, but, uh. Alright. Here's like, uh. Plant right there. And also just go whenever you can. You should be fine. Uh, duck here to output. Oh, resources to market. That's different. Oh, okay. There you go. He's still only level 2. We've not very found many ships to kill off. Which is pretty normal for old world blues. There, go there. Admiralty tech, nice. Even more further reduction in tech costs. Oh. Oh, well, get, just get to the closer. Oh, are they going? Yeah! Go, boys, go! We're gonna take out the Chichenism from this direction. Actually, that might be a good thing to do to take out the Hondurans. Uh, doing it like this, too. Beautiful. Honestly, just let all of you guys come up here. Please, sir. Follow the Chichen Itza. Nice. Ooh, we finally sung something. Finally. We're making it over. Go, bots, go. There we go. Steel frame buildings. Max factories in a state. All sorts of good stuff, of course. Okay, that's gotta be it, right? We're charged ammo. Anything else here? I don't see anything else we can do there. Good. Seriously, where the heck is the capital now? Oh. It's over here, huh? Karaman Ka. Oopsie. Go there. Ah. Sorry, I'm just blue one. This is gonna kinda suck. There we go. Let's get over here and do that. Um, that's fine, that's fine. Maybe from here to there, because that will be a, a VP. From here to there. Here, all the way over there. That'd be fine. Congrats. There you go. Alright, so with that in mind, Mexico's all of ours. Almost. Oh my god, why are you taking so long? I don't want to fight the NCR. I really don't. Maybe we won't. No, just take out Honduras. As much as I want to take out the Legion. I mean, there's such a mess that I don't, I don't want to get involved. It's so disgusting. Just filthy. Also, along the way here, we're going to need some of this. Oh, definitely.
Nice, got a virus. Pretty normal. Energy weapons would be nice. Vehicles. Money-wise, looking very thick. Stacked for cash. Wait, what the heck? Thought we were just applying. I mean, I get some more time for that. Power of the purse, huh? Fleet coordination. Nice. Yeah, I guess we could take out the NCR and whatnot, but I don't really feel like it, truth be told, so... We're not going to. As much as I wanted to do that, oh well. We did get a good chunk of Colorado, all of Oklahoma. Well, good, almost all of New Mexico, too. So... This is a mighty Mexi Republic of Mexico. Holy crud. And Manvar is looking pretty good. Very nice. Wait, do you need more paths here? Do you not reach premature river? Ah, this one. Oh, see, there's a, there's a river there that needs it. That makes sense. Cool. We good? We got one week left. Build ourselves up. Uh, how strong is Honduras? Actually, since we have these guys here. Put them up. Forty-five thousand manpower, up to thirty-three divisions. What is this? Nice. That'll be good. Um, looks like we don't have enough there, but you know what? Do them even dirtier. There you go. First department, merchant spies, very good. Superior armor plating, nice. Tariffs, and we landed. Beautiful. Now we're gonna land again. San Pedro's ours. They're all ours. They've sent all the most, almost the entire army or the military to the front, and but they didn't guard any of their own posts at home. So yeah, La Saipa. Now we got them. Beautiful. Now oh, do we need a, literally every single tile? Come on, Brosif. Why? Why must you pay me like this? Oh, come on. Seriously. What the heck? Hey, is that an energy schematics? Nice. Elevators. Well, no, we finally got that daily air XP game, but whatever. Seriously, you need every single tile. Why? Or what benefit would that bring anybody? And they don't have a unique focus tree. That kind of sucks. There you go. Beautiful. The jungle is ours. We started in the jungle with benefits in the jungle. We're going to end in the jungle. Well, I guess this is, this is technically hills. Close enough. My geography is a little spotty. There you go. Nice. That's a tall Republic of Mexico. Oof. So we're not over yet? Excuse me. I thought the war would be over by now. Um. Well, seems like it's glitched. God dang it. But hey, if you enjoyed the campaign with us playing the Republic of Mexico, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous rest of your day.